Hey everybody, today I'm going to show you how do I do my everyday makeup. So first of all, I just start off with my favorite sunblock from Innisfree. Then after that's done, I move on to my brows. So I usually skip foundation because I feel like it's too much on a daily basis. I drew like a straight line, then after that I pointed two dots. So the first dot is to see where my arch should be, then the second dot is to see where my brow should end. So this is the guideline for the shape of the brow that you want and after that just like fill in your eyebrows and use this fully to brush it off. Then I use this Bobbi Brown Brow Kit for my eyebrows and I just apply it to my brows to make it look more natural and more feathery look. Once that is done, I use the same brow kit as my eyeshadow. So I use the lightest shade to apply into my entire eyelids. Then I use the darker shade of the brow kit to apply into my outer corners and my crease. It looks really heavy at first, but it's okay. You can always blend it out using your fingers. the same brow kit, I use a smaller brush with a darker shade and apply it into my lower eyelashes. Then I curl my eyelashes straight away before applying my eyeliner. To curl my eyelashes, I clip it on my eyelashes, then I move it upward slowly. That way you get a natural curl. And I usually like to curl my eyelashes before putting eyeliner. This way, when I apply my eyeliner, I don't have to keep curling my eyelashes again. As you know, sometimes that might smudge off your eyeliner. For eyeliner, I started off with the wing first, then only slowly move my way in. I find this easier and more controlled. With my favorite lip balm, I apply it to my lips and use this lip tint that my friend gave it to me. After you're done applying, make sure you do this step so it doesn't get into your teeth. Then I use a darker lip shade and apply it into my inner lips as this will give like an ombre effect. This is totally optional but if you want your eyes to pop, you can put some highlighter into your inner corners as this will make your eyes look bigger and shinier. Lastly, just finish off with a dry shampoo and you're done with the look.